In China, 97% of the population has access to electricity. But given China's huge size, the 3% without access to electricity still adds up to a great many people. On the vast and unpopulated plains of Inner Mongolia, herders and business people are turning to new ways to solve this problem. Bater, which means hero, lives alone on the windy grasslands of Inner Mongolia. He tends to 700 sheep and a few cows far from the nearest town. Until 2009, he had limited access to electricity. No fridge, no DVD player, no washing machine. Now he's got it all. It has changed my life. Since my family lives in town, it is only myself here. I can watch TV. Before, with a smaller system, I could only watch one show and it was really dull. Now I can watch all day, so I will not feel so lonely. Bater relies on photovoltaic cells, solar energy, combined with wind power to feed his electricity needs. Worldwide, two billion people live without access to modern forms of energy. And though solar power technology is expensive, five to ten times as much as coal power, it is clean and abundant. China makes 30 percent of the world's solar components, and a World Bank program aims to help develop solar technology and the markets for it. More than 28 Chinese companies have benefited from this program, increasing sales, mostly in the remote rural areas in northwest China without access to the energy grid. We've sold 2,000 home systems to herdsmen. Those systems help those herdsmen with electricity so children can study and leave with lamps produced by electricity instead of candles and kerosene lamps. Because of this project, two million people in western China now rely on solar panels to keep food frozen and, in a place of long views, to expand their horizons. Before the system was installed, it was hard to have fresh meat and vegetables. Now we use the fridge and eat fresh food whenever we want it. And we can watch TV. We watch the news and know what is happening in the rest of the world. Before the photovoltaic system, after sunset, we had to light candles. We had nothing to do, no TV, no entertainment. We just went to bed, nothing to do. China's huge demand for energy is sparking a similarly huge push for innovation. The country is now the biggest maker of large-scale solar cells and a growing maker of, and market for, sustainable energy.